We're on the road in Mendota, California, the home of Michelangelo's Perfect Tomato. While we're here, we have plans to meet with one of our growers to learn why mom uses his perfect produce. And trust me, that's important. We're pretty particular about our tomatoes. We're here to see Ron from Card Cardella Growers. Let's go say hello. Okay. Hi, Ron. Hi, Ron. How are you doing? Nice to see you again. How are tomatoes doing? Doing well this year. It's good weather for uh, tomatoes? That's what God gives us. That's 100 degrees. <laughs> Well, you want to go look and see what they have for us? Yeah, show us one. In its peak season from July through September, crews worked 24 hours a day and picked nine out of every 10 tomatoes processed in the United States of America. Tomatoes can be grown all over the state of California in over 2,750 varieties. Oh, look at oh, that. That's good, oh, that's, that's, that's Isn't that pretty? pretty? Oh. Those tomatoes we love. Yeah, that's why they're so nice and sweet. Because look at them, they're vine ripened. Those are vine ripened. Oh, oh yeah, no, they're ready to go, and as soon as the machine oh. gets here, we'll pick them. Oh. Okay, let me show you something. Oh. Nice and red, ah, that's mm -hmm. nice. That way, if you have to make a sauce out of it, uh, the more red you have in it, the better. I loved tomatoes since I was a kid. My dad used to grow them, and I used to go in the fields and eat them. I probably eat 20 of them a day. Mm -hmm. That's how you know if they're any good or not. Mm -hmm. They better taste good or I don't want to grow them. I don't want to put them in our product unless it tastes good. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys never disappoint us. What, what makes this for you so great to have in Michelangelo's products? Well, I look first for the taste. That's the most important. And then the consistency. The consistency is important because we only use what we call fresh tomatoes mm -hmm. in our sauces. Mm -hmm. We don't use paste in, in the, like a lot of other companies do. So that's why it's important to have not only the, the taste, but also the consistency. Now the skin, we actually have a little skin in our product to get, enhance the flavor. You'd, I don't know if you know why I keep the skin on. Do you know I keep the skin on? Uh, somebody told me that. I know that certain people like it on, certain people like it off. For me, it, it kind of depends on the dish, but a more robust dish, leave the skin on. Right. For me. Well, also, as you know, the skin, right underneath the skin is the nectar, which is right. the sweetest part. Right. And also pectin, which that means I don't have to put any stabilizers in my sauce because it's a natural pectin. In well, that I didn't know. <laughs> you see? <laughs> when you see our product and you read that label and it's clean, there's no other additives and junk in it, no citric acid and those sort of things. For us, that's very important. And to our consumer, it seems to be very important. We were about to leave Cardella Growers when I found out they weren't just growing tomatoes. So Ron, I hear you have a winery. Well, I finance it, but uh, my son has some winery. Wow, that's great. I heard, I heard that uh, some of the people here are saying we should go down there and taste your wine. Or your son's wine, up. excuse me, the one that you pay for. Well, it's mine. I signed <laughs> for it, but he makes it. We invite you to try our wholesome, homemade Italian meals. And join the conversation about fresh ingredients at michelangelos.com.